hello 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 i did it you will do it let's make this money together yes my name is david samoji i'm the owner and founder of what a t-shirt design if you're just joining me for the first time i say thank you thank you without wasting much of time if you're my subscriber i say i really appreciate you i do really appreciate you from now on i'll be giving a shout out to my newest subscribers so without wasting more time we'll just do that so let me just head over to my studio or oh, what's my studio this will not waste your time please click off click off. don't click sorry click don't click off sorry don't click off this is not going to waste your time i always want to shout out join me if you just join me i want to say thank you to all of you yes you can see i say thank you thank you thank you i really appreciate you guys you guys are amazing so if you've not watched my videos please make sure you go down and watch them so without wasting much of your time let's get straight to today's video today's video we're going to be working with canva canva making a t-shirt canva t-shirt design and we're using canva so without wasting much of your time we'll just go straight right to it so to start with we're going to create a new layer custom dimension the standard is 4500 by 5400 so that's the standard Create new, create new. So now we have that. It's going to be a very simple design. It's super simple design. It's not going to take you so much time. This design is not going to take you so much time, but it's going to speak to a lot of people. It's going to speak to a lot of people. So without wasting much of the time, we'll go to shapes. That's elements. You can see. Just wait for it. This is one I've used in the past, so I'll use that again. So now I'll just reduce it. My left mouse click button, drag inwards. Just drag inwards. Move it to the middle. Or somewhere here. I'll change the color. So to do that, I'll over mouse to this edge. Make that red. Or let's make it blue. To make it blue. Okay, we'll make it blue. Then next step is to go to text. We're going to use use one of these texts. As you can see, they are all grouped together, but we don't want to use all. We don't want to use all, so we are going to ungroup this now, and delete the one we don't want, which is wide. Fifty percent off. So now we are left with this. We are left with this. So we we'll just. Control A to highlight that, and it's going to be um, hashtag make it together. As you can see, it's quite it's quite big, so I'm going to reduce that. I'm going to reduce that. Make it together. Going to reduce that to make sure it fits into what we want okay so now we're just gonna drag it in just gonna drag it in and as you can see it's black won't be able to see it super well so we'll change that to white change that to white as you can see so now we have that without wasting more time we'll just go to save please stick around so i can show you the step second step of how to remove the white background this white background you see i'll show you how to remove that i'll show you how to remove that so you stick around if you want that and i'll create an effect so that this white you see here will depend on the color of shirts don't know if you understand but if you stick around i'll show you how to do that so i'll just click on save click on save it's going to save that Now that's gonna save that so we saved make sure you check cross check to make sure it's there as you can see it's there we have it so the next step is to right click and this step you need photoshop to remove the background so open with photoshop open with photoshop we're not gonna waste our time so now the next thing is to click on this folder paper it's going to create a new layer as you can see it has created layer one 
click on layer zero come to your magic word tool this tool here that looks like a magic stick you click on it you click on the white you click on delete sorry click on delete click on fill click on delete and let's see if we can do it for no we can't do it for that i would have loved we created an effect with this so let's see if it works out okay it should work out it should work out so we we'll just as you can see we are just click it on the inside box and we're just you know just trying to eliminate the color so just do that for all if it's too complicated for you, you the best option will be for you to get canva pro so if you want that you can just hit me up and you surely get that in the comments surely get that in the comments so now we have that we we'll just go make sure we position it well you can see just make sure we position it well then we we'll save it as together save us um picture as chat together png we we'll just save it as png and now when you move it to your shirt it's going to give you different colors you can see it didn't take us more time just about six minutes when you move it to your shirt now it's going to create different color let me prove that to you so i'll come to pictures mock up my anger mock up which is my favorite so click on this get this design out by deleting it then i'll find and bring in my make it together design this will be the hashtag so i'll just look for it with the hashtag this is it so I'll just bring it in, just bring it in, reduce it a bit. So to reduce it, you just hover your mouse to this edge, press three button, your alter key button, shift key button, left mouse key button, drag inwards to reduce, drag outwards to increase. So when you're okay, press enter, file and save. Then you go back, it should appear on your shirt, as you can see, it appears on your shirt now you can see that and i think i love it the way it is love it the way it is so now if i change the color of the shirt if i see if i just go around changing the color of the shirt it changes everything everything changes as you can see every single thing changes so that's the beauty of the shirt super easy does not need to be complicated everything is super easy so with that i'll just save this Save it, save us. We go to pictures. My, I save it as this and save. So that should save. As you can see, it's saving. Always remember to cross check that your work saved at the end. As you can see, this is it here. It's saved. So just press OK. To your right, you see my playlist. If you don't want to take long time to learn and wait for tomorrow video make sure you watch playlist from yesterday and way back a lot of videos for you see you tomorrow have a wonderful